she explains why females are evil. Something else that I wanted to say, and a lot of people are not going to agree with this. A lot of people are not going to like this even. But I'm going to say it because it needs to be said. I truly believe women are the most evil creatures on this planet. Hey, Let I got this interesting video. It was brought to you by I Got Game. Y'all go follow that boy. I Got Game. Help him get the 30,000 subs, man. He at 23 right now. But hey, I need y'all to drop y'all cash up in the comments right now. Drop y'all cash up. Drop it right now. Drop it, drop it, drop it. You know, I've been blessing people. I'm going to continue to do that throughout the trajectory of my neck, my uh, YouTube career. I'm going to continue to do that. But the blessing's going to get bigger. You feel me? But hey, we finna watch her explain why she says women are evil. I I'm interested. I, I thought y'all might be interested. So I had to bring it to y'all. Let's get into it explain why i say that behind every single evil man that has ever existed was in fact a supporting evil woman whether it be a mother a wife or a child or a cousin that they decided to marry which would fall under wife <laughs> but no one has been able to do anything on this planet without the approval or it being even not even their idea they got the idea from a woman oh man oh man bro she she might be telling the truth she might be telling the truth a lot of times a lot of the evil men that was in charge really wasn't in charge it was the woman behind them that was literally influencing him but using him for his power to do her evil plan ooh, ooh, ooh. Hey, she putting us on game a little bit because think about it. Let's go to the Bible. Let's go to Jezebel, right? Jezebel was this evil lit, uh, uh, leader of a woman. But in order for her to execute her plan, she had to get with the king. She had to use him. So she used him to basically implement her evil plan of killing all God's prophets and do a whole bunch of sexual immorality type vibe. See, a lot of y'all know who Jezebel is, but y'all don't know the story. But she married Ahab, and I think his name Ahab, basically to implement her evil plan. Oh, oh man, bro. I, I, I be knowing some stuff. Hey, I know some stuff. I think she might be, she, she might know some. She might know some. Because women are the most evil creatures on this earth. We have the potential to be. But instead of actually being in the forefront, like the United States is sending money over to rebel groups in Africa instead of actually involving themselves so they can say, oh, well, it's just those mean, it's just those bad rebel groups. That is exactly what's happening in the United States and across the world, period. Because every evil man was once at some point raised by a woman or is supported by a woman. Some of you are not going to agree with this because you're going to say, well, we don't fight wars. Women are in the military. Women birth boys, raise boys into men. Not just the woman, the man does too. However, nine times out of ten, if a man is raising a, a, a young boy. Uh oh, should... like I just see a comment right now and it just brought me. Let's go back to the Bible. Now, look, Eve. She chose a serpent over Adam. She chose a serpent. The reason we all, you feel me, living in sin is because of Eve. Because she went and chose a serpent. And then look at this. Check this out. Esau was the son of Abraham. Jacob was also the son of Abraham. Jacob was the son of the promise, what God authorized. Esau was the son of the flesh that... The, God didn't authorize, but watch this. Well, I'm, I'm messing up right now. But the woman always chose Esau. The, the the check this out. She favored Esau more. The one that wasn't of the promise. The woman. But hey, let's get into the video. I'm I'm putting I'm dropping game on y'all, bro, for real. Usually married because most women do not like to leave their sons. Now. For someone to hold the power to give birth to a human being on this planet, but in that same breath to play with DNA, emotions, time, and 
I don't know, I guess mental, mental strength. A lot of women will use that opportunity to try to get over on someone, which is as evil as you can damn near possibly get to make a man believe that he has that he has a child and he does not. Now, some will say, well, I think war is the most evil thing. I think, you know, murder and all the stuff is the most evil thing. Any type of unaliving is the most evil thing. And to that, I say everyone does it. Women do it, whether young or old. So everyone is in that pot. And I also think that's why there's this underlying resentment towards women when it comes to men. Women need to control. Women need to control the situation. That's why they're so good at manipulating. I would love for someone to debate me on this. Hey, she kind of got some facts there, but you got to realize only weak men are controlled by women. If you're a weak man, you got to realize like the Jezebel and uh, well, what's my man name? Ahab situation. Ahab was a simp. You feel me? She And she knew he was a simp, so she knew that she can control him. But if you a strong man, ain't no woman controlling you. You feel what I'm saying? We, we don't play that. We don't play them games. You feel me? And the Bible also says in Proverbs, I think around Proverbs 31, it's somewhere around there. It says, do not give your strength to a woman. Don't give your strength to what destroys kings. Proverbs 31. Y'all go read that. So what he's, this is, this is the wisest man that ever lived that God gave Solomon knowledge. He wrote the book of Proverbs and he's telling you that he got his wisdom straight from God. So it is basically God telling you, don't give your strength to women. Don't give your strength to that which destroy kings. So he's telling you that these women destroy kings. And he's also telling you that some of these women will take your strength, take your purpose, take all of that. You feel me? That's why you have to be careful of the women you be around, especially when you out here trying to do the live the vision that God's giving you. The devil will send those pretty women around you to basically take your strength to where you can't even do your purpose. So y'all be careful out there. And always remember, man, be safe out there, kings. I gave y'all a quick little Bible study. I'm telling y'all I'll be knowing stuff. You feel me? But hey, y'all go follow me on Instagram at 200 underscore acres. And hey, see you guys next video, man. Let's get it.